Hello, I'm going to try and teach you how to make a podium map since several people have asked and well, I don't think it's fair to keep it a secret which it's not really a secret. Anyway, what I've got here which is a template uh, that I made is a, a, a small map with a width of 2000 and a height of 200. Now this is important because this here is where your character stands and it's at 1500 or 1510 which I think is more of an accurate number. Now you do need a height map for this if you want uh, a base, uh, an actual ground which is basically just a grey blob. <laughs> you can probably decorate it with like uh, different mountains actually on the terrain and different textures as well but I haven't tried that I don't know where exactly everything will go other than this little corner here is your workspace now these things here these two uh, stones are your camera and where your character is facing this is your camera this is where you'll face and roughly about the height you will face. I've kept this in every single podium map I've released and you can't see it but it is there. With this stone you can see if you keep it in your podium map which is why I usually delete it beforehand. It's honestly no more different than that. Uh, these two stones are at 1540 uh, both X and Z and with the X of the camera being 1490. Um, there's honestly nothing oh uh, there's honestly nothing more to tell you about the actual map making. Now with this podium to export it this map name and must be podium it can't have anything extra on or your game will crash. I've learnt this the hard way and it's it, 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 it's, it's annoying to find out so we could just save that as podium there we go export it and now what you want to do is in your exports find podium and any items you use say uh, not the, my water, my stru my structures, my rocks, they, they'll all be included but anything extra you've used like wildebeest or gazelles, lights, things like that that you have exported with the map you'll need. So what you do is you copy this and over in Media Terrain's FH Maps you paste it and replace. So now if we exit the game just go into creative den and there we go now it is a bit off but my uh, my I'm not completely correct with all this but it, it's it's general you can see it, it's still there and you can see where the character faces but you can't see where the camera is and you can zoom in and out all the rest of it and you've got all this space behind you to fill so that concludes this tiny tutorial, which was a lot shorter than I expected, really. I hope to see many new fascinating podiums out there, and I might try a 